A lot of times I see people in renderings and they think that's enough just to add people into the rendering. It's very important to know that the lighting has to come from the correct angle. And so I'm gonna show you how you can light people into your scene correctly and so that they fit into the image. From the start, they are lit in the correct direction. And so if you look at our rendering, the majority of the light is coming from the left side and moving to the right. The right side is much darker. If I look at this image, I can tell that my people are lit correctly where the light is coming from the left and to the right. Now, if the opposite was happening, I would simply flip them. And so what I would do is I would just say edit, transform, flip horizontally, and the lighting would be correct. Unfortunately, you have to make sure that the perspective is right too. So if the image was like this, this image right now leads me to think that these people are getting ready to cross the street and walk out into the street. And so it's very important to choose very carefully the people that are going to be in the right direction, in the right perspective, and it has to make sense in your image. Now, this really wouldn't work. It's a little bizarre to have people crossing a busy street with car streaks and cars moving so fast. Again, that's part of telling the story. It's important to make sure that not only the lighting is right, but the story is working together. And the stories of the people walking are lining up with the story of the rendering. So let's go back and flip it back. So this feels more correct to me. And they're walking along the sidewalk and everything is correct. And typically what I like to do, because I'm going to create layers for my people, I like to put people into groups. And Photoshop allows you to create groups. And there's a little folder here. And if you hit this folder icon, it will create a group. I will call this people. And you can put your people into that group. And anything in that group, you can leave on and just turn the group off and it will turn off everything in that group. The other advantage too, is you can start coloring your layers and you can start coloring as you create more people and layers for those people, things will get complicated. You can begin to color code your layers. If you right click, you can choose colors and we can say red and it will highlight everything that's under that group as red, which is helpful. Let's delete these layers. So the very first thing I'm going to do is to make sure that my people in general are lit the way the rendering needs to look. And so to do that, I'm actually going to create a adjustment layer, just a temporary adjustment layer, but a hue saturation layer. And I'm going to desaturate everything. And what that does is just from looking at the rendering, I can very quickly tell if my people are too bright or too dark according to the rendering. And right now they're very close to where they need to be. But if my people were over on this side of the rendering, it would be way too bright. Right here, they're probably just right. But right here, they're a little bright. So I will show you how to do that. So I'm gonna add a levels adjustment layer. And we're going to add it to just our people. So make sure you turn on the arrow. And we're going to pull this control up. And what this controls is the output level. So this is the output level of my whites, the output level of my blacks. And if I want to make them darker to match the scene, I will pull this up. So as I pull this up, the people will start to fit into the scene much better. And that's probably where it needs to be. And looking at it in grayscale, it's very easy to see what's too bright and what's too dark. And so once I have that levels on there, I will turn that off. I'll turn off my grayscale. So I'll turn that off and that's looking much better. If I turn my levels off, you can see that the people to begin with were way too bright for that foreground area. So now they fit in, they blend in much better. So that's the first adjustment to the people.